Hello, and welcome back to our Getting Ahead Together video series. This time, I'm in Belgium talking about vaccines, both the exciting innovation and technology that's powering them and the tremendous role that they play in preventing infectious diseases and protecting human health. Today, I am here with Jesse Goodman, former Chief Scientific Officer at the US Food and Drug Administration, and a science expert, very importantly for us, on the GSK board. And also here with Himran, one of the many fantastically talented people who's part of our vaccines team. It is absolutely amazing when you see these next generations of vaccines coming through and the scale of impact and, and prevention of hospitalization as well. It's, I think, fascinating time to be in vaccines today. Thanks to new technologies, I believe we are entering a golden age in vaccine development. We still have many diseases where we don't have a vaccine or where available vaccines can't protect everyone. So the work that we are doing feels really purposeful. It's great to hear that. Uh, I was wondering what got you into medicine and then into vaccine science? So since young, I've always been curious about nature and the world and always wondered how medicines are actually discovered and developed and brought to patients. And I can't believe it's already 15 years since I left a large public hospital in Kuala Lumpur to join GSK. So what about you, Jesse? I think it starts with my grandfather, who was a chemist and an early biochemist, helping set me up at home with a, a, a real chemistry lab in my house. I'm surprised the house survived. <laughs> you didn't blow anything I up, did you? I never <laughs> blew anything up. I came pretty close. But I just was so fascinated and so addicted to trying to understand how things work. And I realized that both in infectious disease, I could have a tremendous global impact. And by helping GSK, I can have an impact making the products that we need to prevent all this terrible illness, to help us face the next pandemic. How have you seen the role of vaccination evolve over time? It has just been a really exciting journey, both for vaccines and then for me as a physician. We've made tremendous progress in our ability to make vaccines, in their quality, their purity, and their safety. Exactly, as you said, I think the WHO have said two to three million deaths are prevented each year by vaccination, whether that's from newborns through to adults more and more, and probably the biggest global health intervention we can make beyond basic sanitation and, and clean water. Kumran, can you explain a bit more to us about vaccines technology and the kind of approaches that you and the teams are using? Tech plays an amazing role in vaccine development. This means we can speed up the process without compromising on safety and efficacy. And the sooner we make these vaccines, the more people we can help. We use a broad suite of tech, maps, adjuvant, mRNA, so we can have the biggest impact to help get ahead of diseases like RSV, influenza, pneumococcal disease, meningitis, one of the latest addition in our toolbox, MAPS. One of the advantage of MAPS technology is ability to incorporate multiple antigens ranging from 20 to 30 in one single vaccine. I mean, that's what's just so amazing is the, is the pure scale of the impact that this kind of work uh, can have. Uh, and, you know, I, I know it's a source of great pride in GSK that we vaccinate 40% of the world's children. All that most of us see is a final vaccine uh, in the doctor's office or in the pharmacy. But behind it all, it is such serious uh, commitment uh, from outstanding talent with phenomenal expertise, all with safety, quality, and most of all, a sense of enormous responsibility right at the core of what they do. That is how we unite science, technology, and talent to literally get ahead of disease together.